I wanted to talk about like procrastination a bit. I come up with anything and everything I can to not do. I just wanted to talk about that like while I was in that space of like, oh my gosh, I need to move forward, but I can't. I'm working on a commission and every time I have a commission, I do the same thing where I have a hard time starting on the final. I have my miniatures, which I can looking at in the screen, but on, they're back there. So like the mountains and the women, and I have all of them like figured out what I want it to look like. I know in my head, I've done the mini sketches. I know the size that the client wants. Uh, the half payment is down and I've shown her the sketches. She likes them. We decided to move forward. I got like a photo of where it's going to go. So I know like which direction to face the woman, all of those things. And getting started is always this like hurdle where it's really, really challenging for me to start on the final, uh, especially when it's a big final for a client. And it's, it's just like, it's a, I know I can do it. Every commission, I do the same thing though, where it's on. Uh, sometimes I'll even give a, like I'll give a date, a deadline for a sketch on the final size so that I make sure and do it by that date because it, I don't know how, I don't know how to explain it, but there's like this emotional, psychological like hurdle that I have to get over. There's almost this sense of like fear or nervousness or I don't know exactly what it is, but it, I, I procrastinate for my, I, I, I had it written down to do it Monday. Then I taught Tuesday and Wednesday. So I could, I didn't have time to do it Tuesday or Wednesday. And then Thursday I was like, okay, I can do this today. Instead, I invited several of my mom friends over to make granola with me. And, and then I was like, well, I can do the sketching part at night because it'll be, so it'll be fine. But then I was like, I didn't do it. My husband watched football and I was like, I will hang out. And I did like some stretches and practiced uh, like the flying pigeon pose. I can't do it. And it's a challenge. Like I just do like, I come up with anything and everything I can to not do the first steps. And once I get it, once I get the pencil outline down, once I get the first layer down, I'm good. There are stages on, I would joke that like, with watercolor paintings, there's like an awkward teenage boy stage where you have to get through like the puberty of the painting where it starts out really cute and wonderful and pretty and then you have to push it to where it doesn't look good and you're like, oh, this is awkward and you have to push it farther and it, it comes out together. Like that's always been my process with watercolor. And I find that when I push it too far and then bring it back, what well, feels like too far and then bring it back, that's when it's a finished good composition, good piece, good painting. So like there's there's like hesitancy at that stage because I don't know what to do and so I usually sit on it and wait a couple days. But the starting, oh my gosh, it drives me nuts. So I'm going to do it as soon as I finish this. Do you experience this? Are there stages in your process where you have a really hard time moving forward? What stages are those? Why, what causes it? Um, how do you handle it? Um, thanks for watching my channel. If you enjoy art, culture, travel, diversity, and all of those things, stay tuned. Also, if you like what I do, check me out on Instagram. I'm very active there right now because I can do that with the changes that life has been going on in life with fostering and uh, teaching some and all of that. So check me out on Instagram and I will see you guys. Thanks.